Welcome to William Carey Wednesdays. My name is Landon Adams, and I am here in the Center for the Life and Work of William Carey with Dr. Benny Crockett. Now, what we're talking about today is a recent acquisition, a book called the Hittopadesh. Could you tell me a little bit about what that book is on? Yeah, the Hittopadesh originally was a Sanskrit book, a Sanskrit, a major language of India that was the parent language of many of the languages in Northern India. But Sanskrit itself, and this book in particular, the Hitto Padesh, it is a collection of Indian fables and proverbial wisdom. It is similar to the West's treasure of Aesop's fables. And so it's a book that helps people that Kerry was teaching at Fort William College learn to speak and read Sanskrit. And so he's dealing with British East India Company civil servants at Fort William College, teaching them through the literature of India itself. Now this book, uh, there are 11 copies of it that we know in the world. There are four in the United States, uh, one here at William Carey. Well, it sounds like an exceptional, rare find to have this housed here. Now, a question that comes up to me is, is why would the, what we call the father of modern missions, William Carey, why would he translate a book of Indian fables? So the ultimate purpose here for this collection of this book is to say to people is that being a missionary means that one is immersed in a culture for the long term. And that Dr. Carey did in India for 40 years and never wavered in that commitment.